Hello guys and girls, Foxy Raven TV here with another Fallout 76 video and today we will be checking out the Stalker's Prime Light Machine Gun here and this one has bullet explosive for area damage and it's a Stalker weapon so it has, if not in combat, 100% VATS accuracy, at 50% AP cost and 25% less VATS action point cost. And uh, yeah, this this weapon actually only have the prime automatic receiver or the standard mag, uh, I mean receiver. But um, yeah, we'll be checking this out today because I have been seeing more and more people use this, so I wanted to check it out. And sadly, I did not get a two shot explosive. I have been crafting a few of these to, uh, today, and uh, actually the whole week, weekend, and so on. Um, but this is actually the best weapon I got, so yeah, I got a lot of trash, for sure. But um, yeah, we're not uh, gonna do this uh, in in vats. Actually, maybe we will a little just to see because this this is not a vat uh, a wet build, as you can see. This is uh, a tanky full health build here. So over at strength, we have these. As as you can just pause the video, I will just be going over them uh, fast here. Uh, just so you get an idea on my build here. And this is pretty much it. And if we go over to the legendaries here, this is what I what I use here. And, uh, whoops. For the mutations, mutations. We're using Adrenal Reaction, Bird Bones, Healing Factor, Master Pale, Scaly Skin, Speed Demon. And as you can see, it's quite tanky. It almost has 400 health, and we only have 207 AP here. And as you can see, we are actually quite tanky here. Uh, the damage resistance and so on. We're using the Strangler Heart Power Armor, uh, because I have the Calibrated Shock for it. So, yeah. Anywho, let's see what this weapon can do against a behemoth down here. Hopefully no one have, have killed him. It seems like he's up. He's up. Oh, it's it's hard to control if you just spread it like that. Oh yeah, the AP just... But yeah, two magazines. Little less than two magazines, and he's he's dead. He is dead. Dead, dead, dead. Let's check out the super mutant. So, <laughs> and the, didn't we do this in the, in, the, in another video? The eviction notice <laughs> or oh, whatever. Uh, I actually think we'll try the hunter's well just today. We always do the west tech, and I actually like the hunter's well as well. And when I started recording, I did see a person over at West Tech, so he might have cleared it out. I actually don't know if there's any super mutants here. We'll check it out here. So yeah, the weapon here is it's doing it's doing all right. It seems like. I mean, there's nothing wrong with the damage for sure. Damage is just fine. Yeah, the damage is fine. It's hard to control if you just spread it. So a two-shot explosive would have been ideal to just to sp just to f spray and pray really. But there's nothing wrong with the damage here. Not at all. I mean, <laughs> look at that. Oh, I'm not hitting here. Come on, there we go. Anything good? Frag grenades. I don't not. I don't want that on this character here. Let's get up close and see if we're dealing any damage to ourselves. Yeah, we're dealing some damage to ourselves, but it's nothing we can't handle. And of course, we have the medic pump on this as well. So when we get down to 50%, we would heal up. And also. We are healing quite fast, anywho. As you can see, we're full health already here. Yeah. 
So from this this distance, it, it doesn't do much, huh? Ah, it's still dead. He's still dead. Dead meat. I actually think we killed them all here. We did. So let's go over to the Myla Queen here. Just to check out if uh, if she is uh, an easy target to kill with this weapon. So this weapon actually seems like it's doing quite well, in my opinion. The spread when you when you just fire fire it is insane though. But uh, let's get sneaky here and see. Yeah, that's not bad. Still a caution. What the f? This is a loud weapon. <laughs> this bows from this distance. It's. Oh yeah, she, she <laughs> almost half health. Well, yeah, a big target like her I means it's easy to kill. Oh, could you not get in there? Oh. So yeah, a little more than two magazines, and uh, the Myler Queen was dead. So it's actually, it's actually a good weapon. Ain't gonna lie. What was shooting her? I can hear sh bullet bullets going off. Where is the Maya King? Where the f is he? I can hear him, right? No. There's no Myla King? What the F? No. There's not. Uh, I feel like using this... At, nah, I don't want to do this event here. I mean, it's meh. Let's actually do the Mole Miners just for, for good old times here. We used to do robots, Mole Miners, Super Mutants and uh, Behemoth and so on. We actually used to go a full, full round down here, but um, let's just do a few mole miners here with this weapon. It's actually kind of decent, I, I have to say. I did not expect it to do this well because of the bad rolls, but uh, it seems like you just need need explosive bullets and you're good to go, just like that. Wow, yep. This is not half bad. It is actually decent. And the spread seems to be okay as well. So he has shotgun ammo, but fires a rocket. That makes sense. Should be one more, right? No, it's it's dead. No, uh, no bobblehead up here. No. So yeah, there you have it, guys and girls. Oh, we have one more. Where is he? Oh, that, down there. There we go. Dead meat. Actually, dead meat, as you can see. <laughs> so yeah, this this weapon is actually doing all right, in my opinion. It's a, it's a lot of fun. I will be using this for sure. Uh, yeah, the damage is going up as well. Because when you kill something, yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah, this is a decent weapon to use. And uh, I understand why people are using this uh, right now. It's a lot a lot of fun to use for sure. And it seems like it seems like the uh, the C and D the durability is actually quite strong on this weapon because. I actually, I, I think we only used a tiny bit here, but uh, yeah, I have to, to look at the video to tell. But anywho, guys and girls, that's it for, for this video, and I will see you in the next one. Take care. Bye-bye.